one of my videos today I'm going to be making banana fritters and here I have all my ingredients I have four overripe bananas they have to be overripe if you want your banana fritters to be sweet and as how you could tell that the bananas are sweet the brown spots indicate that they are sweet so we have four I'm gonna be using four all right bananas so guys don't ever throw away your bananas there's always something that you could do with your bananas if they're overripe so I have my bananas I have my vanilla I have my sugar this is granulated sugar you can you can use brown sugar if you want but I'm using what I have and so I'm using granulated sugar um, nutmeg this. salt I have my cinnamon powder and I have my flour as you can see. okay so I'm gonna start by crushing my bananas and my sugar and mixing it together okay I'm gonna be using half cup of sugar you can add more as you go along depending on how sweet you want it but I'm gonna start out with just adding half a cup sugar is because I don't want it to be too sweet I don't want the sugar to overpower the taste of the banana so I prefer to add as I go instead of dumping and having it too sweet add one gram of salt one and a half grams of nutmeg two and a half grams of cinnamon powder a splash of vanilla and mix I might use more depending on the consistency as I go along so I'm, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to add little by little and deter and use that to determine if I need more flour or not Wow. 
Okay guys, so after testing it with the spoon, I think I'm gonna go ahead and add the rest of the flour. So in all, we used a cup of flour. And then mix. So the next step is to get your oil hot. It has to be super hot for your fritters to fry properly. If the oil is not hot, then your fritters is just going to be soggy and it's not going to be fritters. It's been about three minutes on this side and they're all done. 